Seven. System high pressure protection E1. When E1 appears, please check if the cut valves of gas pipe and liquid pipe are fully opened. If they are okay, please check other possible causes. Two. When E1 appears, power off and then power on. Turn on the units. Reset the unit into the original operation mode and operation quantity, and check if the fans of outdoor unit and indoor unit operate normally. If not, please check the connection wire and mainboard of fan. If everything is okay, please replace the motor. Three, high ambient temperature in operation. The highest outdoor temperature in cooling is 50 Celsius degree. And highest indoor temperature in heating is 30 Celsius degree. When the actual ambient temperature exceeds the limit, protection may appear, which is a normal phenomenon. Four, pressure sensor is not working properly. Firstly, check the pressure sensor and connection wire to make sure if the high pressure sensor and low pressure sensor are connected properly. If they are connected improperly. Please reconnect them. If they are connected properly, please check if the high pressure sensor is in good condition. The checking method is as below. Stop the whole system. After twenty minutes, test the high pressure and low pressure of the system and convert the pressure into the corresponding saturation temperature. Compare it with the outdoor ambient temperature. If the difference is larger than seven Celsius degree. It is abnormal. Please replace the sensor. If the malfunction still exists after replacement, it means the mainboard is faulted. Five, high pressure switch is not working properly. If E1 appears after power on, but the compressor doesn't start up, it means the high pressure switch is not working properly. Firstly, please check if the pressure switch is conducted with the universal meter. If it is not conducted, the valve is broken and should be replaced. If it is conducted, please replace the mainboard. Six, the pipeline is blocked. Power off and then power on. Turn on the units. Reset the unit into the original operation mode and operation quantity before protection. If it is in cooling mode, touch the liquid pipe along the flowing direction of refrigerant to feel the temperature difference. Check if the difference is big or part of the pipe is frosting. If it is in heating mode, touch the gas pipe along the flowing direction of refrigerant to feel if the temperature difference is big. If the above mentioned phenomenon exists, it means the pipeline is blocked. Seven. Excessive refrigerant charging amount. If the above mentioned causes are excluded, please check if the additional refrigerant charging amount is correct. If it is excessive, please discharge the refrigerant from liquid pipe until system pressure returns normal. Note: Do discharge refrigerant from liquid pipe 